In this video, everything you need to know when going to Tenerife in October, not only the weather and what to expect at that time of year, what's going to be opened and what's going to be closed, but also where you should be staying at that time of year on the island to have the best holiday and if this is actually the right time for you to go or not. And if it's not, don't worry, there's also a full guide in this video to when is exactly the right time for you to be going to Tenerife. October is still a pretty hot month, even though theoretically summer is over on Tenerife at this time. It's still 26 degrees on a high on average and on a low on average is 20 degrees Celsius. But do know that there's also plenty of days, it's gonna be much hotter than this. October, even though a little bit after the real summer, is still a nice and sunny month with 12 hours of sunshine each day. October is the first month after summer, normally it starts to rain again, but it's only two rainy days each month. And do know that most of this rain either falls on the mountain or on the north side of the island and away from most of the touristy destinations in the south. Even though October is the month that it starts to rain again for a beach holiday, it's still very good because the sea and ocean temperature at this time is warmest one of the year. So if you like to spend a lot of time on the beach and swimming and in the ocean, then this is a great time for you to go. In October, normally everything you want to see and do on the island will be open. But do know that if there is a small chance that a park needs to do updates or renovations, they might close a part of the park or the entire park towards the ending of October. But this is very, very rare. Normally everything is open and you can go and visit everything on the island. Also, most of the bars and restaurants on the island will be open, but some of the smaller ones in the smaller resorts, especially the family run ones, they might take a little break towards the ending of October. If you want to go clubbing or partying at this time of year, then there's only one good place to go on the island and that is Playa de las Americas. If you're looking for a cheap holiday, this might actually be one of the best months to go as the overall climate on the island is still very nice, but there's not so many people normally visiting this time of year, so you can find some really good budget deals. Taking into account pricing, weather, but also what is open, the following are the best destinations in my opinion on the island this time of year. These are Los Cristianos, Playa de las Americas and Coste Adeja. Hi, my name is Eve. I lived, traveled and worked all over the Spanish islands for the last 20 years. So definitely, if you want to have the best holiday possible, have a look at these videos as well and subscribe and click the bell notification because once a week I come online here live and answer all your holiday related questions live here on YouTube. So make sure to subscribe, click the bell, then you are informed next time I am live.